Oh, there we go. Frantic is entering the flag firing zone. It is about to start happening, guys. It is about to start happening. This is going to be awesome. Oh, lordy. Uh, yeah, this ain't going right. This ain't going well. In fact, I think we're going down. We need to make sure we can land. Oh, Jesus, it is on fire. That one hit me directly. Oh, God. Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another Stormworks Build and Rescue video. Today, I thought we would do something with the flak once again. Now, it appears that we have actually got the flak mod working once again. You just have to be an experimental in order for it to work, so that's what we're doing. Anyway, today we're going to be flying this South African Airways Boeing 747 to the flak zone, and we're going to try and fly it through it and see how well it deals with it. So, let's go ahead and get inside, take off in this thing, fly to the flak island, and see how long we can stay above it. Let's go. All right, so we're on the inside. Let's go ahead and get inside, inside. There we go. Get inside as well. There we go. Close the door, and let's get in the flight engineer's seat and turn everything on. So... All of those are going to turn on right there. The engine powers, they can't go on just yet. Uh, we have the extinguishers up there. The bleed air's up there as well. We're actually going to turn on all of those right now. That makes sense. Uh, heaters might as well go on as well. We need to turn on the batteries, but I'm not entirely sure where the batteries are. Where are the batteries at? Is it down here? APU, APU, starter. No, where's the battery? Is it up here? Oh, there it is. All right, cool. Batteries, uh, anti-ice stuff. There we go. That makes sense. Uh, economy mode, APU, starter. There we go. Uh, hydraulic systems, they all need to go on as well. Let's go ahead and do those. Uh, reserves, we don't need to do that. That's all fine. Uh, we are good. All right, fuel pumps, they're going to go on right there. Okay, good. Let's turn the economy mode off for right now. Engine powers, let's go ahead and turn those on. And engines themselves, let's go ahead and turn those on. All right, very good. I think that's it, actually. I think that's it. Let's go ahead and sit in our little seat. Is there anything down here? We got our cutoffs. Let's go ahead and turn on all of those. And make sure the engines work. Yeah. So it has actually been a while since I've actually even tested this plane. We're gonna go ahead and turn on all of these things now. So nav lights, anti collision lights, uh inboard landing lights, we don't need those. Logger lights, we're gonna go ahead and turn those on. Avionic gyros, interesting. Engine one, TMS, and oh there we go. Nice. Fasten your seatbelts, everybody. We are almost ready to go. Uh what else do we have? PA systems, we don't need those. How do I turn the lights on in here? I don't know how to turn the lights on. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Alright, well anyway, now the engines are running, we can turn the APU off, that makes sense. Uh, there's the light button right there, we are ready to go. Master caution, turn that off. Uh, parking brake, where's that? Release parking brake, alright, we're good. Uh, let's go, throttle up and let's take off with this thing. Oh yeah, flaps down, let's do it, there we go. Oh, this is awesome, this thing looks beautiful. All right, so we are in fact moving. We are currently going like, what in the world? <laughs> we were like driving on the front steering wheel. That is really weird. That's very strange. Anyway, lift up the landing gear. It should be right there, which it is in pretty much every plane. That is awesome. Landing gear has gone up and we are flying this beautiful plane in the sky. Nice. Okay, so if you look down there to our left, that is the Black Island right there. Let's go ahead and go that direction. Uh, we are also going to go ahead and do this stuff. So, roll damper, we'll put that on. Uh, pitch level, we might as well put that on. Flight director, we should put that on as well. And we are good. We need to put our coordinates in as well. So, set this as a place to go. Uh, I don't know where we put the GPS in. Oh, there it is. Okay, go ahead and smack that on. And that is awesome. Altitude hold should go to about 4,000. There we go. And turn that on too. That is awesome. Good. So we're going to get over to the uh, the waypoint and flak should start happening. Oh, there we go. Frantic is entering the flak firing zone. It is about to start happening, guys. It is about to start happening. This is going to be awesome. It's going to be so good. All right, there you go. Frantic has entered the flak firing zone. It should be starting any second now. Uh, what else do we have? Oh, it started. Flak endurance challenge has started and the flak is actually happening. All right, keep this thing flying pretty much in a straight direction. That's okay. Keep going. We need to keep going as quickly as we can uh, in order to make sure that we get to the place where we need to get to. Yes. Although, actually, I think we're going to have problems pretty quickly because this thing is not, is, is not small. It is not small at all. In fact, I think we've lost engines on the right-hand side already. Uh, okay, right. Turn altitude hold off. 
turn the GPS autopilot off as well. Okay, there is apparently a fire, but that's okay. We've apparently turned ourselves all the way around. But apparently by accident, though. I haven't really put anything in to do that. Uh, and we do have fire. Do we have a cargo bay fire exp expulsion? Uh, extinguisher, that's what I meant. APU extinguisher is going to go on. Because apparently we've got an APU fire. Okay, that makes sense. Alright, keep flying. We got this. I want to stay in the air for at least like two and a half minutes. Although two and a half minutes isn't really that long, is it? I don't know. I think we got this. All right. So if you guys are enjoying this video at the moment, uh, obviously you guys can see a sneak peek of the future here. But uh, if you guys are enjoying it, please leave a like on the video. That would help me out a lot. And uh, please subscribe if you enjoy this content. Anyway, I uh, hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video. We appear to have lost an engine too. We've lost engine, what, three? Engine three needs to be turned back on. Come on. Let's get over there. Sit in this seat. Good. Sit in this seat. Engine three. Where is it? <laughs> Where is it? I'm levering the flight firing zone. That's completely by accident. Uh, APU starter, we don't need that. Generators, uh, extinguish this. It apparently has been extinguished. Turn on the power. Turn on the generator. And try and restart the engine. It's not working. It's not working. All right, get back over there. Come on. Yes. All right, it's working. Don't worry. Oh, we've lost another engine. We've lost engine one. Oh, Jesus. Oh, lordy. Uh, yeah, this ain't going right. This ain't going well. In fact, I think we're going down. We need to make sure we can actually emergency land this thing, though. Uh, in fact, let's go ahead and throttle down just a little bit. Okay, good. Parker very quick. We're going to turn that on instantly. Thrust spoilers. We don't need those right now. We need to make sure we can land. Oh, Jesus. It is on fire. That one hit me directly. Oh, God. All right. We appear to be, like, going, like, directly straight down. That is never a good sign. Uh, we're going to deploy the flaps a lot more. There we go. Uh, auto brakes, we'll go ahead and slap those on. Backlights, we'll slap those on. Uh, we appear to be going down. There is fire and everything. Uh, I'm not entirely sure what to do. I can't pitch up. Um, oh, no. Roll damper nut. Right, okay. Turn this on. Altitude hold on. Let's do it. Come on. Uh, get back up here. Turn the reserves on. Reserve hydraulic systems. Do it. There we go. We might have, we might have fixed something. Uh, this seat is broken. Co-pilot, do you have any control? I don't think the co-pilot has any control either. We are going down. Mayday, mayday. We are going down. Oh, mayday, mayday. We are... Oh, wow. We are engulfed in flames. We've got no control over this thing. Uh, we can't actually abort. We've got radar, <laughs> interestingly enough. Uh, flaps are already on full. Trim up. Is that right? I think that's right. Uh, trim all the way up. That's fine. Okay. And uh, cut off the engines that are on fire. Oh, wow. Two minutes, 45. I think that's our longest time. We do appear to be going down, though. So that's an issue. I can't do anything about it. We are still descending. Uh, we are still exploding a little bit. Our flaps are all damaged, so they're not actually down. Uh, we've got no control over our, our pitch. Uh, we are dead. We're going to die. Somebody save me, please. Somebody save me. It's happening. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. We're going to land. All right, there we go. That was actually kind of soft. We need to abort. Get out, get out, get out. Wait, we're actually, like, okay in here. It's it's actually sealed inside. That's amazing. Uh, but we do need to get out. Come on. Come on. Oh, Jesus. Is the entire plane sealed? That's... Oh, no. Oh, no. The bottom floor is, is not. Uh, that door is... I can't open that door. This one, I think, is okay, though. Open the door. Let me out, please. There we go. Oh, boy. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. Okay, right. Come on. Over onto the wing. We're okay. We are We are a-okay. Hot diggity dog. All right. Well, I guess this plane is, is slowly going to sink. But what we want to do first is I'm going to actually try and close this door to allow it to sink slower. Uh, and I kind of want to get a tugboat out here to see if we can do anything about this. But uh, I don't think we can. All right. Close the door. There we go. I don't think we've got anything to actually attach onto in order to actually pull the plane. But um, I, I think that's it. I think that is it. Yeah, this thing is going to sink. And we can't really do anything about it, which which really sucks. Um, but anyway, uh, <laughs> I think I'm going to end this video here for now. The flag challenge is one of the most fun things to do in Stormworks for me at the minute. Uh, if you guys have anything that you guys want me to actually fly through the flag, let me know in the comments down below and we'll do something about it. But anyway, for right now, I'm going to go ahead and say thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.